Hello, this is Carl with another Joomla tutorial. This one is going to be on how to update Joomla 3.0 on your local host with Womp Server. Uh, Womp Server has an error that comes up, but we'll get into that in a second. Uh, so what we've got here, uh, the way you normally update Joomla 3.0 is you go into Components and right here Joomla Update and I'm going to click there and you'll see that we're going to get an error. An error has occurred, unable to find the socket transport SSL. Did you forget to enable when you configured PHP? Well, this we are going to fix right now. So I'm going to return to control panel and uh, then I'm going to downsize that. Now I'm going to go down to the system tray and there's three things that we need to change in WAMP server. So we're going to left click on there. We're going to go to Apache, hover over that and then we go to Apache Modules and now we see this uh, menu setup come up over here. We're going to go all the way down to the bottom and we got to click a bunch of times and we go to SSL Module and we just click there and it will put a check mark next to it and you'll see that the, uh, the WAMP server icon here turns to orange, it goes offline and in a second here it'll come back online. There we are. That's green. Uh, it says offline, but it is actually online since it's green. Um, so now we go to uh, PHP and we go to PHP extensions. And up here we go to uh, open uh, PHP underscore open SSL. And we do the same thing here. Click that. And our WAMP server goes orange and now it goes green again and now just to confirm that we've done what we wanted to do we'll go back here to PHP extensions and we come up here to open SSL and that does have a check mark next to it we come over here to Apache Apache modules back down to where we were Da, 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 SSL module and that is checked so we're good there and WAMP server is back on it says offline but it's actually online so um, alright so we come back here to components Joomla update and click on that and now we get what we want to see here which is the normal Joomla update screen we're going to go from 3.0.3 to 3.1.1 install the update and it may take uh, 30 seconds a minute to do this but as you can see the error is gone so I am just going to say that this is good well you know what I'll, I'll edit this and we'll uh, I'll, I'll talk on the back end so here we are we have now updated successfully to version 3.1.1 and that's all there is to it. Now, uh, normally with a local host, uh, when you're working on this, on Joomla on local host, you're not going to run into this type of thing. Usually you're going to want to update uh, when you get to your, uh, your hosting service when you move it over. But uh, in this case, I was running as, into some errors that were being caused by the older version of Joomla. So uh, this will take care of that and onward and upward. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please comment below. And as always, uh, please subscribe to this channel if you find this useful. Thank you much.